All right, today we're going to clean some fuel injectors. So I've got a Mustang here that has got a, uh, a misfire diagnostic code on the computer. So we're going to try our best to clean the injectors today. So what I've got here is a uh, turkey baster. Uh, it's just what I had laying around. A, a simple syringe would do uh, the same. I think it would be just fine to use it. I've got some STP fuel injector cleaner. And we put some here in a plastic bottle container so that uh, we can fill our syringe up, as you can see here. And so what we're going to do now is we're going to take this and come over here to our lab, if you will. And I've got a little piece of 3 8 inch uh, fuel hose. So, and I've already got the little... Uh, adapter screwed into there that's off the turkey baster so we're going to screw that into here like so all right and you can see here I've got the fuel injectors out and got them labeled uh, so that uh, they go back in the same hole that they came out of so I'm going to take the number one injector here I'm going to try to put this between my knees here. We'll see if that's going to work. When you put this hose on the fill injector, make sure you get it on the right end. Uh, if you put it on the wrong end, once you put the battery uh, to the injector to trigger the solenoid, uh, all it will do is dribble out. Uh, don't ask me how I know that. So uh, typically the end that you want to put it on is going to be toward the electrical connector, at least uh, on most of the injectors that I've seen. Uh, one thing that you can uh, use as a guide for sure is um, uh, whichever part the fuel rail connects to, that's uh, the end that you want to put the hose on. Okay, so here we have the turkey baster. And it's full of uh, fuel injection cleaner, 3 8 inch fuel hose, and a fuel injector from a 2000 Mustang. So I've got just a standard car battery here, some banana clips. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the banana clips and I'm going to put one of them on one part of one uh, terminal and I'm going to take the other, put it on the other terminal like so. Okay. And then I'm going to take this Close pin, and I'm going to stick it in the middle just so that uh, they don't touch. All right, try to get that in focus here. All right, so now I'm going to take this butterfly clip, put the positive one on the positive terminal, and this is where I'm going to put the camera down. So I'm going to put pressure on the turkey baster, like I'm squeezing the uh, fuel injection cleaner in it. And as I touch it, you see it's squirting out. Got a good stream there. Good streams are always important. Y'all, if you ever have a bad stream, you need to go get that checked out. See that one's shooting pretty good. You see, I'm just touching this thing just for just a quick millisecond. Triggered that solenoid in the fuel injector. And every time I do that, it's shooting out a part of the cleaner that I've got in the syringe. And there we have it. Hopefully we got a clean fuel injector. 